to my YouTube channel. If you guys are new to my channel, my name is Aurora. I am at Aurora Jacinda on Instagram. And I am bringing you guys a video that has been highly requested on my Instagram. So I will start out by apologizing if my voice sounds a little crazy. I woke up with a sore throat yesterday and I've been feeling better today, but it's still a little raspy. Um, first, we're going to start out with leggings. So my favorite, absolute favorite pair of leggings is Balance Athletica's OG leggings. I wear a size medium. These run for about $70. So I am showing you guys the tie-dye ones today. So I will incorporate the video of me actually wearing them. So they have the booty contour on the back. Um, and I have heard a lot of people say that the tie-dye are the softest ones, but I, I just think that the fit of these is perfect. I think these are a lot more flattering than the Ascend pant, even though the Ascend pant from Balance Athletica is still in my top like five favorites. I'm gonna show you those today as well. These are my favorites. So again, I wear a size medium, and for reference, I am a size six in American Eagle. I'm a size six in um, Lululemon Alliance. I'm pretty much a size six across the board. I typically wear a size medium in all of like my tops, um, my activewear tops, and I wear like a size small in most like everyday tops or blouses. But yeah. So I'm right now I'm 140 pounds exactly trying to get down to like 132, 135 for my wedding, but I comfortably sit at like 140 pounds. Also, I can probably get up to 150 pounds in everything that I'm wearing here. I'm five, three and a half, two for reference. So that is my absolute favorite hands down pair of leggings. Then next up we have, of course, you guys should know this one was coming but the Lululemon Align Pant. I'm showing you guys in the camo color. Um, I don't think they have this exact one anymore. They might. I've been looking for the green camo pair for a while now, and um, they're sold out like everywhere. But anyhow, these are obviously great, especially if you just get like a plain back black pair. I have like three or four of those for everyday wear. I have multiple colors of these. These have more of a subtle booty contour. Um, I do like the OG pant better for the more dramatic booty contour, I'll say. It just looks a lot more flattering, but love them. Extremely soft, feel like butter. Awesome. I feel like the OG pant from Balance Athletica and the Lululemon Align Pant are very similar in fabric types. Next, we have the Navigation Seamless Legging, which if you are looking for something to go do a HIIT workout, you're doing a high intensity workout, these are more of like an active pant. Both of those pants I wear to the gym all the time, have no problem doing any of my workouts, but I know if you guys are big into more of like an active wear feeling type pant or a sweat wicking type pant, then these are gonna be for you. So these are the Navigation, seamless leggings this is actually the reveal um seamless legging so it has a little bit of a booty contour um like some of their other leggings it does not have like the darker color on the side but it has this really cute mesh detailing like around your calf and i love it so i wear a size medium in these as well and like i said i wear a size six in the lulu ones that i just showed you so these are awesome and actually later on i'm going to show you the sports bra that matches these super stretchy um, extremely, extremely flattering. Just make sure when you wear them that you make sure that this contoured piece is like put at the right part of your butt or it'll look a little silly. Next up we have, oh, I was going to show you guys too. These are the um, navigation. These are the contour seamless leggings. So these have all the contours. This has the side contour and the booty contour as well. So just like the ones I just showed you, um, but I will say the reveal seamless leggings I showed you in the aqua color, those are a lot more stretchy and softer feeling um, than these, but these are absolutely amazing, the normal ones. I'd say they're super similar. So the nice thing about these is they range for about, four, or they're about $48. So I think that's awesome for a pair of high quality leggings like this compared to like, obviously the Lululemon Alliance are like 98 and then the Balance Athletica, like I said, was 70. So those are prices, if you guys were wondering. And next up, we have the Paragon Sakura leggings. So I feel like these are super, super underrated. So these are amazing, guys. 
I don't think they have that many left on the website if they have any and I'm really hoping they bring them back because I love them. So a while ago these were released as like the $25 leggings. Um, they had like a one day sale thing and they wanted to like get everybody to like try this pair of Sakura leggings. So actually I, I wasn't able to buy a pair like they sold out before but my mom actually had went on and got a pair so she gave them to me which was super nice. So these are from Paragon. They have a very subtle booty contour on the back, but they are so freaking flattering. And these have pockets, which I'm obsessed with. So it's like, it's like the texture or material almost of Lulu aligns, but it's a little bit more compressive and it has pockets. Love these. Super underrated. These do have a front seam, which I at first was a little bit worried about because obviously camel toe, we don't want that, but does not do that for me. Those are a little bit less high-waisted than all the other ones I've showed you, but still high-waisted, super flattering. Last but not least, we have the Balance Athletica Ascend Pant. So here's the back. It's got the more dramatic booty contour. I love these. Like I said, not as flattering personally on me, but these are a lot more like sweat wicking for more high intensity workouts than some like the first two I showed you, the Lulu Alliance or the Balance Athletica OG pant. So obviously you guys can go on their Instagram page too and like look at the differences between fabrics and such, but I'm a size medium in these as well. Next up, let's get into joggers. I have two favorite joggers. I will say I haven't ventured out and tried that many, but I feel like once you find a jogger that like just fits your body perfectly, like you just stick with it. So first one, I have the Buff Bunny. These are the Jasmine joggers. I wear a size medium. These are awesome. So I can wear these pretty high waisted and they're extremely, extremely flattering. So. They have like the tight ankle at the bottom, um, but yeah, I love these. The fabric is super soft, very impressed. And these are, they're between $24 and $54. So I looked the other day when I was getting all this information together for this video and they had some on clearance. So definitely go check that out. But normally they're $54, come in a bunch of different colors. We have the Align Joggers from Lululemon. So I just ventured out into trying these. I had a gift card I got for Christmas and I had saw some other videos that said how awesome these were and guys, I am obsessed. So it's literally the same thing as a Lululemon Align Pant. I feel like the contour on the back is a little bit more than a typical Align Pant, but not much. Um, these obviously have the pockets they fit super similar to their leggings. They're just like a little bit bigger around your legs. And then obviously they have the pockets. I wear a size six in these. And just in case I didn't say it, I wear a medium in those Buff Bunny joggers. Love them. So that's all I have for joggers because I typically don't wear joggers that often. I wear those as more of like going to run errands, lounging around the house, whatever. I typically don't wear those to the gym. But next we're going to get into sports bras. So I will say that sports bras and leggings are where I typically tend to spend most of my money. I would say most of it on leggings, um, but sports bras too. And then I feel like with jackets and hoodies and tops, you can spend a lot less money there. But you want to have quality sports bras and you want to have quality leggings. Now, I do have obviously some high quality hoodies, jackets, and tops as well, but I definitely think you are better off spending your money on the leggings and then going cheaper on a top. But for sports bras, we are going to get right into it. First off, um, my absolute favorite, thousand percent worth of money. This is the Lululemon Free to Be bra. This is actually the Free to Be Wild bra, but any of the Free to Be bras are bomb. So I wear a size six in these from Lululemon. Obviously the back is so freaking cute. It, this is just extremely flattering and these last for forever. I have a black one that I've literally had for probably almost four years now literally nothing wrong with it. No pilling, no nothing. Next up, we have this Rosa bra from Buff Bunny. This is a size medium, $40. So a lot cheaper than the Lululemon bra. Love it, it is more of a long line bra. Comes in a bunch of different colors. I know that they still have these on, in stock on the website. And then it's got kind of a fancier back. I just love how flattering this is. Like it doesn't give you kind of like that armpit bulge. I take the pads out of all my, 
sports bras by the way so yeah every single one of these had pads i took them out i don't like them next up we have a balance athletica bra this is the or a bra and it was 46 dollars um the back is really cool love the long line you can definitely wear this as just a top you don't have to necessarily wear it as a sports bra you can wear it as a top too like it's long enough so very cute size medium then next up we have the unity bra from balance athletica the fabric and all of their bras are just so soft i can't wait to get more so size medium this is in the color blush very cute love the open back it's more of a high neck bra too next up i wasn't gonna do this as one of my favorites but since i'm gonna show you guys i obviously already showed you guys the leggings i thought it would be cool to show you the matching sports bra this is from um, navigation this is their seamless sports bra in the color aqua and it's only 23 dollars so like the balance athletic bras were 46 the buff bunny bra was 40 the Lululemon bra was 58 and this one's 23 So I wanted to be able to show you guys something in all kinds of different price ranges. This is amazing. Again, I took the pads out of this one. I could probably size down to a small in this one as I have a medium and everything else. But very cute. There's the back. Just a super simple seamless bra. But like I definitely prefer like these over Gymshark. Um, so next up we have shorts obviously living in the midwest i don't get to wear shorts that often other than um spring summer a little bit towards the end of fall um so i don't have that many shorts but now that i've found like my two favorites i know kind of what to get again so my absolute favorite is till you collapse so this is the back these are the heart booty shorts and I can get these in my normal size medium. This is the only shorts that literally are true to size, I feel like, from anywhere. So size medium, heart booty, these have pockets. These come in a bajillion different colors. They actually have a bunch on sale on their website right now. So if you guys are interested in shorts, go check them out. These are high-waisted to extremely, extremely flattering on your stomach. One last thing I have to tell you guys. These are the only shorts that do not ride up or roll up on the bottom for me. The only shorts I've ever been able to find that stay in place. And I think it's because it has the seam on the bottom. Obsessed. And those shorts are between 40 and $30. So super affordable. Next up we have the Lululemon Align shorts. These are like the four inch length shorts. I sized up two sizes in these and they're definitely big. Like I should have only sized up one size but they're comfortable, there's not a problem with them. So these are actually in a size 10. So they have the contour on the back and these run for $58. So yeah, definitely size up one size in these, um, if not two. So that is it for shorts. All right, next up we have jackets and hoodies. So the first one that we have is the Balance Athletica. This is the um, Elevate Zip and this is in the size medium so this is the crop zip it was $65 um, I actually got it for my birthday I had gotten like that whole tie-dye set um, with the Ura bra so there's it zipped up very cute extremely flattering I typically wear this to the gym um, with the Ura sports bra in black that I showed you guys earlier. It's a little bit more long line, but sometimes at the gym, I'm not all that confident yet in wearing a sports bra around at the gym. So I like to wear this over the top. If I didn't say this is a size medium, typically I will like kind of zip it like halfway. So there's that. Fabric is amazing, super stretchy. I would say that this runs pretty true to size. If you're in between sizes, I would definitely suggest sizing up. The medium's pretty, pretty compressive on me. I probably could fit into a large, but I like the medium. Next up from Elfalite. This is another one of my favorites. I could literally buy every single color in this. I know these are still available on the website too. This is the Elfalite Crop Hoodie. This is in the color Powder Pink. This was $50, um, and this is a size medium, so it's so cute and cozy. So I like wearing this with like my align joggers. This comes in a bunch of other colors too. Next up and last but not least for jackets and hoodies, 
I have this really cute navigation oversized crop quarter zip. This is in a size small. It's still pretty big on me. And it has this really cute little thing at the bottom that you can make it like tighter on your skin. So that is it for jackets and hoodies. Next up we have tops. So I will literally tell you guys the best tops for working out absolute best are from Amazon okay so this top right here which of course it's inside out never fails I wore this to the gym on Thursday um, so this is very very similar to what Balance Athletica had just released with one of their recent collections so this is actually like a tie back long sleeve top. This is in a size small. I forget exactly what the company is, but if you just search Amazon tie back tanks or tops or long sleeve shirts, you will find one. If you guys want the direct link, message me on Instagram. If you're like between a small and a medium, don't be afraid to get the medium because you can tie this back tighter or make it into a crop top. There's so many different things that you can do with this. And those are like $15 on Amazon. Next up we have Navigations Crop Tanks. So this is a size medium. These are literally $19. Absolutely love them. Love the quality. It's more of a cotton, but it's more of a high quality cotton. Absolutely love it. Just very simple razorback crop top. Next up, extremely comfy, cozy, cute. You can make this into an everyday look as well. This is um, Elf Elite Long Sleeve crop top and this was $28 this is in the cream color very subtle print on the front very cute next up this is the Columbia crop top from Paragon in the size medium so just extremely extremely flattering on your stomach I know this one right now is only available in like one color online but they're often doing restocks or pre-orders so keep your eye out for that Last but not least, I have these in a couple different colors. This is from a company called Sparkle and Sweat, and this is in the size small. I have a size small and medium. I definitely prefer the size small. It's in like this really cute, cute black marble color, but they have a bunch of different other colors. Um, so this one was $25. The Elf Elite crop that I just showed you guys was $28. So very cute. All right guys, so those were about 20 of my favorite activewear pieces. I hope that you guys enjoyed. These are definitely pieces I feel comfortable, I feel confident in, pieces that I feel like have the best quality and are absolutely worth whatever I paid for them. Leave some comments below if you guys enjoyed and what videos you wanna see next. If you did enjoy this video, make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.